Hello everyone, uh, welcome back to Ostriv. Well, um, uh, we got here a trading dock um, operational now. So um, what I'm going to do is um, set up some stuff for export over here. And we'll put up, uh, yeah, we'll put up a bunch of charcoal for export. And we'll uh, come in here, uh, sunflower oil, we'll also export that. Um, now, what else do, can we uh, export here that's going to be uh, appropriate? Well, uh, you know, I don't think there's anything else that's particularly exportable. So I'm going to leave it at that. We've got full staffing here. Uh, we'll look in the uh, resource supply options. Oh, come on. Um, we're going to allow laborers to uh, uh, and you know by hand as well. Um, yeah. Okay. So that that's going to get uh, get stuff uh, appropriately confused. Now over here, um, oh right, yeah, we've got that uh, other farm online here. So uh, ultimately I'm going to end up putting in uh, some more farm fields uh, over here. Um, where's the edge of the, there's the, uh, there's the border. Um, yeah, I should probably put a suggestion to Yev to use something other than red on green there. Uh, I think that's red. Um, it does not show up at all for colorblind people. So, uh, yeah, I should probably uh, send Yev a suggestion on that one. Um, right. Okay, so we got 410 people. Two empty houses. So, uh, and we have uh, migration turned off. Now, we've got uh, this thing up. Now, let's uh, take a look at the world map. Um... This is our new trading town, so, yeah. Uh, it only costs 20 to send a messenger. We'll send a messenger. I just want to see this uh, river trading thing operating. Um, yeah, uh, so we're at the, uh, we're coming up in, into summer here, so, uh, right. Well, I'm going to up-tempo it here. Um, I'm going to up-tempo it here. Yeah. Uh, anyway. Um, yeah, so the idea here is to get... Uh, get enough of these here uh, farms operating that uh, there's enough um, uh, food. Uh, okay, we have a messenger. Uh, they're selling salt... Uh, they're demanding sunflower oil in export stock. Well, we'll do fourteen ninety three then. Deal. Um, and I'm going to buy all the salt. Yeah. Uh, okay. So uh, you know that obviously it works exactly the same way as trading by. Uh, other messengers so yeah that's uh, kind of cool i just want to see so a boat should arrive at the dock here uh that should be interesting um look in here oh that's cool we got a boat we got boats coming yeah i just want to see this um uh, since this is new i want to see how the uh which way does the boat come in that's going to be the fun part. Um, ah, there it is. Yeah, coming down the river. Cool. Uh, okay, our uh, stuff here, the hay barracks for our new um, stuff over over here. Where is, wherever it was. Uh, over here is... Uh, is uh, on is starting to come online. Oh well, yeah, so there's our, our trading boats. They're sailboats, which is kind of cool. 
Yeah. Yeah, they're sailboats. Huh. Okay. So, let's see. What can we see in here while they're... Oh, come on. Sweet! Now, what have we got? We have all the salt. Yep. Good. Well, that's, uh, that's trading. Uh, there we go. Um, right. Uh, so, what I uh, suppose I should do, uh, I'm going to um, add a field. Uh, <clears throat> we'll put it here. Oh, nice. It tells us how big things are now. Uh, 50 by 50. Uh, come on. There we go. So that's a maximum size field. Uh, okay. Add a field. Uh, Durkachi. Whoops. Whoops. What are you... Uh, you'll take charcoal. We'll, we'll sell that. Uh, sunflower oil. We'll sell that. Do we have any? We'll sell some of that. Uh, shoes. Do we have any for export? We'll sell some of that. Might as well sell some buckwheat too. Yeah, we're uh, we're good there. Um, yeah, so we might as well do that now. Uh, back to here, uh, building uh, fields. Uh, here, well, I'm gonna go up here. Fifty. Um, rotate. Too long. Fifty. Come on. 50 by 50. Fifty by fifty. There we go. Right. Okay, so now we're gonna have a couple of uh trees that need to be removed. And I'm going to try one more field. I'm just going to run this field from the uh, existing farm. Okay, you can snap there. Uh, you can snap there. Uh, you can go there. And then we can... Do this. Yeah. Okay. So, um, so we'll get the trees removed from there. Um, I'm also pondering building another, uh, another, uh, forestry. Um, don't really need to though. Um, anyway, these guys will uh, take the trees out, so you know that will uh, then we'll have three more large fields here. Uh, and what are we growing here? Potatoes and hemp, and we're growing wheat and hemp. Uh, 
Okay. Um... Oh, we're harvesting. And we have one vacant house. Uh, you know what? I'm going to move these up to the front. Then I'm going to actually build these houses. Yeah. Yeah, I'm going to actually build the houses now. Uh, so that'll fill this area in. Um, right. Uh, we got... Uh, I think we need more people. Yeah, I think we need more people. Uh, so once the uh, the houses come online, I'll uh, enable uh, uh, migration inbound. Um, yeah. Okay. Well, that is uh, removing the trees, so that's good. Um, so. Uh, for all of you that actually watch this, uh, if you care enough, you know, leave a leave a comment. Um, uh, if you have any idea like what you want me to try with uh, with the game, uh, then uh, you know I'll I'll see, I'll see about doing that. Um, also, uh, I'm pondering a uh, starting a new save um, and maybe trying the new map that you have just released. Uh, I'm not uh, not entirely sure on uh, on on that. Uh, I kind of want to get this uh, this save uh, stabilized a bit more, and uh, you know get the uh, the agricultural production going uh, a little bit better. Um, you know before uh, before uh, starting again. Because uh, I want to be able to uh, to set up uh, farms with maximum size fields and things like that. Uh, I want to I want to do things a little more um, efficiently uh, uh, this time around. Because you know you really don't need uh, all of the farms that I built here. I'm kind of using them to store employees. Um, so we've got here uh, houses that are going to uh, come online uh, real soon because our our builders now have something to do, right? Uh, and that should be uh, should be exciting. Now there's a lot of room left on this uh, this map where we could potentially uh, build uh, a big stack of uh, additional stuff here. Uh, so I'm not sure. I'm not sure if I'm I'm going to uh, going to do that. Um, now if I go in here, uh, no, I need to find City Hall. That's over here. Allow migration. Yes. We should get a family move in. Right? Yes, we should get a family move in. Um, so I think we need another 20-odd people to, uh, uh, to really keep this ticking along. Uh, so I'm going to get a uh, bunch more in and then we'll see what happens. Um, yeah. Now let's uh, take a boo over here at our cemetery. Uh, yeah, we got enough plots in there still. Uh, yep, there's a new family. Uh, And what did we get? Uh, two, uh, two adults, two kids. Um, yeah. Well, uh, there's that. Okay, we got another house up. Um, okay, so that's, uh, that's ticking along nicely. Um, I'm actually uh, very impressed by the depth of the uh, gameplay uh, in uh, in Ostriv so far, uh, considering uh, uh, considering uh, that it's basically just one guy working on it, and uh, you know, like, uh, like if you look at how how complete everything actually is, 
it's absolutely phenomenal uh let's yeah we don't have unemployed people right now um so yeah we definitely want more people to come in um yeah yeah it's that's uh well this is uh this is ticking along um you know what i'm gonna move this one up here let them clear that one tree and then uh then we can see what that's uh that's gonna do um this one here is hungry because they're broke right oh i want to take a look in here we're doing okay here um Let's uh, drop the house rent and let's go look in here. Uh, sunflower oil, we can sell that. Deal. Um, shoes. We can sell that. Clothes. We won't sell that right now. Charcoal, we can sell. Um, do we have any wheat in export? No. Uh, okay. Yeah, because we have uh, we have uh, trading uh, income operational, we can uh, definitely uh, sell uh, other stuff. So, uh, like we can definitely reduce costs and that sort of thing. Um, okay, so what have we got here? We've got um, uh, we've got um, sunflower oil. Uh, we've got uh, flour, we've got, uh, we've got some beef, uh, we've got buckwheat, which they'll eat, um, but I think I'm producing enough of it, I can maybe raise chickens with it, um, and we've got uh, potatoes, um, yeah, so, um, generally, uh, the, uh, the people should be happier. Um, now, flour, we, we're producing some. We've got a stack of wheat. Uh, okay, so, uh, what are these guys doing? Um, okay. I might need another windmill. That might be, uh, that might be good. Uh, yeah, I might perhaps need another one. That means I need more, uh, I'll probably need more people again. Um, right. Where can I stow one? Probably over here. Um, okay, we'll go in here. Uh, windmill. Uh, place is occupied. Oh. Uh, oh, I can stick it here. Okay, I'll stick it there. Uh, you can come up here. So they'll build it, and then, uh, okay, now this here, all trees planted. Okay. Demolish. Now, uh, we'll go back over here. Um, we'll go over here. We'll plant trees. Come on. Uh, snap. Uh, you can come out to here. You can come out to... Nope. You can come out to here. What does it mean place is occupied? Uh, you can come out to here. You can come out to here. Come on. Uh, and you can come out to... No. You can come out to here. And then to here. Yeah. And then they'll remove the trees, then they'll plant it, and then we'll be laughing. Okay, whoops. Um, 
kind of wish escape would close whatever's open and then bring up the menu. Uh, yeah. Well. Uh, yeah, that can be at the back of the uh, queue. That's not urgent. Um, yeah. Okay, we've completed the windmill. Now, let's go over here. We'll add some workers. Uh, resource supply. Laborers. Yeah. You want to make sure you allow uh, laborers to supply things. Um, resource supply. Yeah. Uh, because if you do, then your laborers can potentially have something to do off-season. And that, uh, that means there's uh, fewer people that will be sitting around idle and you'll have fewer people that are uh, broke. Uh, right? Uh, and that, uh, that potentially uh, makes a huge difference. Now, uh, where are we at here? I think we're at a point where the game isn't really speeding up in the... You know, we've got a messenger. Let's take a boo here. Well, he'll buy buckwheat. Okay. Uh, shoes. Yeah, we'll, we'll sell that. Uh, charcoal. We'll sell that. Sunflower oil. We'll sell that. Clothes. No, we won't sell that. Um, right. What can we buy? Uh, salt. Lime. We'll buy the lime. Uh, okay. Um, what do we have for uh, iron here? Uh, okay, we'll buy the iron. Deal. Um, okay. Uh, right. And we've got a stray uh, do doohickey thingy here. Oh well. Uh, right. Well, um, yeah, I think this game's largely at the point where we're going to be doing a lot of uh, waiting. Uh, but what I'm going to do is I'm going to run through the cow sheds. Um, there, uh, we'll get rid of the excess bulls. Uh, go in here, do the same, uh, yep, one there, one there, one there, yep, done, done, Yep, and over here, don't want that, or that, or that, or that, or that, or that, or that one, or that one for that matter. Yeah, and we'll come in over here. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. 9, 10, 11. What a lot of these. Well, we're going to have a lot of heights. Uh, that's for sure. Now let's uh, get that going again. Now the reason I paused that was so that... Uh, so that the... Uh, uh, the interface didn't redraw while I was uh, clicking through things, right? Uh, you know, when uh, somebody came and took the actual animal to slaughter... Uh, anyway, uh, let's take a look in here. How's our uh, hides collection? Way too much. So, uh, tannery. We need a second tannery to keep up by the look of it. Okay, production. Tannery. 
Where is it? Tannery. Well, let's uh, let's throw that up. Right about here. Yeah. Um, oh, no, our field isn't cleared yet. One tree left. Uh, okay, so they'll get that tree out, and then uh, then we'll be good. Who are you? You're over. You're from over there. Uh, sunflower oil. You're demanding that. Export. Two thousand. We'll export. Two thousand. Yeah. Okay, now, over here, uh, we're going to grow, um, what are we going to grow? Uh, potato, maybe, or sunflower? No, we're going to do potatoes, and then hemp, and then fallow, and this is going to be fallow then potatoes, then uh, hemp, yeah, and this is going to be hemp, and then fallow, and then potato, right, and it's April, so let's go in here, uh, active, 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 Okay, we got our reforestation area up there, so they're going to plant some trees. Uh, okay, now we're building uh, building a tannery, um, right? Ah, we're uh, plowing. That one's on follow, right? Yeah. Okay. Well, we're plowing those, so... Um, right. You know what? I should just move that to the back of the queue. Um, get the houses up, because we definitely need more, uh, more villagers. Um... Yeah, yeah, we definitely need more villagers, uh, and our uh, money's going down. Anyway, that's not a uh, huge issue. Uh, that's what trades for, you see. Uh, right. Well, there's a house up. Yep. And uh, well, we're sowing. We're sewing there. We're sewing there. Okay, yeah. Yeah, so everything's uh, ticking along, so we're good. Uh, right. Well, uh, I'm going to put the cut here. Um, yeah, so it's uh, it's uh, ticking along nicely. The I kind of like the field size uh, indicator. That makes uh, placing things a lot nicer. And uh, yeah, uh, things are uh, th things are doing pretty well. Uh, the first time I got up to 400 residents, there was a lot of uh, stuttery uh, goodness and stuff like that. And this is going pretty smoothly. So uh, anyway, um, I really want to get chickens or something like that online. So uh, I'm going to uh, get the population up a little bit more to make it a little more sustainable. And then I'm going to see what I can do about that. So maybe next part I'll be building a chicken coop or two. Maybe not. We'll see. Anyway, uh, that's going to be all for this time. So stay healthy. Don't let the ongoing apocalypse get you down too much. And, well, see you next time.